Hello friends and comrades, it's me, freezing my butt off in the Ukrainian plains, and welcome back to Ostriv, and to our little frozen town in the middle of nowhere. So, last time we started to have some problems and some troubles, and we also had some questions come up that we didn't know how to answer, but luckily, John Lore in the comments, Johnny Lore, has, um, has, has offered us some suggestions and some help. Where is my chicken coop? Oh, there. I can increase the hatchlings limit like this. Okay, and I will do this. And I will just make it so that we can have a million hatchlings. Uh, and they also suggested that we focus on money. Oh, no, not on money. <laughs> they suggested we pause the, the camp, we pause the church, and we begin to focus on farming. Uh, and... I've been told, <laughs> I've been told to click the question mark in the, in the building thingy. Wait, where is it? Where is the question mark? How do I? Oh, there it is. So, this is the thing. I have pressed some question marks in the past and they just didn't explain me well enough. But apparently the farm question mark has a lot of info about how you can grow crops and stuff. And we could have avoided like three videos of me being confused by this. And now we we have some info, we have some help. We received some help, so that's good. We need to hire managers for these farms and then they will allow us to, to create like a crop rotation situation. So that's good as well. I don't know, can we just hire a manager at this point? Hold up. Oh yeah, we just don't have men and I guess only men can be managers, huh? Yeah, we are, we're kind of running out of food, so our current goal is to get some fields. Now, um, I think we've made it so that these cows can go out to that pasture. Uh, and now this field, could, we can link to... Oh, can't we assign during season? But when, when, when is it not season? See, this is, this is what I don't understand. I want to link this field, this field, I want to link this field to this farm, but I can't. I don't know how. It says, can't reassign during season, but it's literally season all year round. That's the, 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 that's the, the, that's the thing that's confusing me. But other than that, at least we've got cows going there now instead of over here, so that's good. Can we unlink it somehow? It says this is the only pasture now, so... I don't know. See, this is what confuses me. But I think we should build extra farms. I think that's what we were told to do. So uh, I'm going to build a farm on this side. I still don't know how it is with the distances and like how far away a farm can be and so on. But, you know, we'll we'll see. So we'll just build it here. And we want to prioritize this, ha this farm. Uh, so we're going to build it first. And we're going to have some more fields. We were also told, let's make the game a little bit faster, we were also told through the comments that, yeah, that we need to make sure that we have crops, animals, fishing, and other production, and also that we, that we don't have to worry about money. That's the other thing. So I'm gonna try to build also another, yeah, let's build another fishing dock. Did we already build one at all? Don't think we did. I feel like we were thinking about it, but I don't remember if we did. So we should just build a fishing dock over here. I feel like that's probably a perfect place. So these should be built as fast as possible. But yeah, even if we go into the negatives or people get paid, I think what the biggest concern right now is we have to make sure that we have food so that these people do not um, starve. It's a little bit more important than paying them. So I guess we can go a little bit into debt, which is nice. But yeah, this is this is going to be what we want to build and we're just going to let them build and we'll get back to you when it's built. All right, here we are. Most things have been built and winter is over and let's take a look at what these people want. Ooh, they're offering quite a lot of things. Now, I was told that we can still buy stuff. Oh, my phone wants something. We're just going to throw that away. Yeet. I was told that we can still buy stuff but we cannot, like we can still just go into debt. So that's good. Do we have any sunflowers? Can we, can we sell them? Can sell, town storage. Well, that's, that's, that's not good, is it? 
Okay, so we'll just... Do we need to buy... You know what? I'm just gonna buy five more live chickens. How, how much is that? Ooh. I feel like we should, though, because, like... I don't know, maybe that'll make it faster for us to make... To start making our own eggs. But yeah, so the other question that I have... Let's reduce this. Is... How and when and w how many how many fields can we have during um oh what is this how many fields can we have per farm and how far away those fields can be and all these questions it's kind of hard to know right because like oh sure we can add a field but can we add you know six fields or how many fields do we have per farm that's the big question. So I'm just gonna make three. I don't like the way that I've shaped it, but you know what? We'll 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 live and learn. We're just gonna hope that three is a good number. I feel like we could probably have more. Wheat is very important, but let's talk about what else we could have here. There was wait, there was a really cool thing on the Discord. I'm gonna look that up. Okay, so the crop rotation guide that's pinned on Discord, that's also from the wiki, says that the optimal food yield is potato, buckwheat, potato, and then fallow. And it's kind of, I think that's what we're going to do with these two fields, and then with this one, we're just going to go for wheat, because I feel like you can never have enough wheat. You know, we need to feed it to the chickens, and well, that's kind of the main thing that I wanted for. I don't want our chickens to starve. So, yeah, I feel like we should probably have more, more of that. And I feel like that can be a rotation of like wheat and hemp or wheat or potatoes or wheat or buckwheat. There's a lot of different ones that you can do. Max wheat is apparently wheat, hemp, wheat, fallow. So we might do that one. But yeah, let's, let's go ahead and let them do these. And again, we want a manager and we want some workers. <gasps> we have a manager. Okay, okay, this is excellent. So this means that we can, um... Oh, this is wonderful. Okay, I get it. I see how this works. Okay, cool. And I want the same here. And for this one, we want hemp, wheat, fallow. Okay. I feel like this should be... This is, this is kind of... Th this is good. This is good. I'm happy with this situation. And over here, we also have a manager now. Excellent. So... Let's do the same thing here. We want maximize wheat on this one. So we're going to say wheat, hemp, wheat, fallow. Wheat, hemp, wheat, fallow. And then what else do we want? Yeah, I feel like this is going to be nice. It's going to be good, right? I I trust our people to do, to do a good job. I guess that's an easy way to see whether it's enough fields or not. If um, we just take a look and if... If all the fields get sown in time, then that means we can add more fields, presumably, right? It's just kind of like, just experimental. Oh, and I also want to see the fishing place that we made. Um, oh, we can, we can order a boat. Oh, we don't have a boatyard. We should build a boatyard. Okay, okay, hold up. Boatyard. Where is boatyard? What are the hotkeys for these again? One, two, three. Okay, good. That works. Okay, okay. Boatyard. Is it under production? There it is. Okay. Should we just make a boatyard next to it? Sure. Sure, sure, sure. And then I also want to add a fishing dock on this side. Ooh. Oh, uneven terrain. Uneven terrain will be the death of me. Okay. I guess two dock, two boats means two peeps. But let's make this like that, and yeah, I I think uh, I think we're we're on our way to something good. We're on our way to not having an absolute crisis. But also, here's the thing: we have a lot of things that will be like one, two, three, fallow. So we're just gonna have one season or one year where we are absolutely like not doing well. So here's my plan: why don't we change this one so that it's like this? Presumably they're gonna rotate by themselves, so this should make it so that, you know, it's it's the same- wait, no, that's the wrong- the wrong way around. It's the same pattern. Wheat, hemp, wheat, fallow. 
and the only difference is that in this case it's gonna go to fallow next time and hopefully that's gonna that's gonna uh, delay some of these problems for us do we know which times the different seeds grow is that a, a bit of knowledge that we have or do they all grow in the same time how is that how is that delineated I guess we'll just have to do some experimenting. So one of these seed, uh, one of these fields is already completely sown. Now the other is in the process of being sown, and then this one is completely unsown. So that's that's where we are in this situation. And over here we've got kind of a similar thing. We've got a field that oh no, we don't have nails. Do we have to start buying nails? How do I see my materials again? Um, I forget. Oh, there we go. Nail. We need iron. We don't have any iron. That's the thing. Do we have to buy iron from people? But we can't send out a merchant right now. So we just have to kind of wait for them to get here with a messenger. Well, I think we should prioritize feeding people then with the stuff that we have. Oh no, they, they, they did get the nails somewhere. Okay, that's, that's fair enough. Okay, question is, why are we not selling potatoes? We probably have potatoes. We're selling milk, honey, beef, potatoes. Where did we get honey? Why are we trying to sell honey? What, are, what, what else do we want to sell? What are we producing? Uh, fish, I guess. Ooh, dried fish, though. Is that better? Can we dry the fish? How do we dry the fish? Is there a production house that lets us dry the fish? There's a thatchery, blah, 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 blah. Don't think there's a fish dryer. I don't know how many workers per boat either, so let's just, just do it like that. Okay, everything is growing here, and everything is growing here. So presumably that means that we could add more fields, right? Um, but I don't know when, again, when is the season of, of sowing and the season of reaping. I don't know if that's going to be too many fields or not enough fields or what it's going to be, but... Um... Oh wait, those are with plows. Oh no. That's a with plows situation. Okay. So we may have made a mistake, it's fine. Um, I guess we gotta we gotta change up our plans a little bit. This one is for plows, this 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 little way of doing it. So we've gotta change that one up. We can't have a third thing. I think that's gonna be simple. We just cancel this and it'll be fine. Where are sunflowers though? Oh, so buckwheat sunflowers. So okay, okay, okay. I guess this one's already in season, we can't change it. Oh, we can, we can, okay, okay. Buckwheat, sunflower, okay, cool. So next season, we're gonna see if these ones are also all filled, and we'll see if that works. And on this side, I want to add another one as well. But first, let's make sure that, again, we remove the, the plans for plows, because I, I messed that one up. Here's a question, do they just rotate? Do they rotate? Like, so, if this is the case, is this the same as going buckwheat, sunflower, fallow? Will it rotate, or do I have to come back and tell them, like, you have to do a thing? I feel like they're probably gonna rotate. And I'm gonna add another field. Um... Hmm, where are we gonna add this field? Maybe here. To the side. You know what, I'm gonna go wheat. You know what, no, I'm gonna go buckwheat, sunflower, Hello. Ooh, a messenger is visiting. What will you sell us? Um, you have a lot of demands, but I don't think we've got any of this to sell you. Yeah, 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 yeah. We don't have much to sell you. We can sell you some wheat. I guess we can reduce our, our um, minuses by just selling you, like, 500 wheat. We made some money back, it's fine. And then we're also, oh, you know what I would like to buy? Wait, did I have, um, I guess we need bulls to, to multiply our cows, that's a thing. Uh, so, you know, that's a concern. If we just get cows without bulls, they're just gonna die out and they're not gonna multiply, right? So, 
I don't think we should we should buy that, but maybe we should buy a little bit of iron. I will buy just this much iron. Okay, thank you. Family is out of food. Oh no! Don't worry, people. We have got so much food incoming. I don't know if it's gonna be enough, though. Maybe we should have gone for more food. Also, I like this little... <laughs> little bit of trees that we've got here. I don't know how this is gonna work out. Oh, we can... We can make dried fish in the fishing dock. It's the same thing. There's a limit that we can define. Okay, 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 okay. I guess... Oh, no. Family's moving out. We're out of food. Families are moving out. No. I guess dried fish is like a luxury we can't afford right now. So we're just gonna sell you regular old fish. That's gonna be what we're gonna sell. Regular fish for food. Oh, look. We're harvesting. We are harvesting. Yes. What's that? Oh, it's a it's a trader coming in with iron. We should have maybe bought some food. But I thought we were gonna produce enough food soon. No worker to load trade wagon. Oh yeah, I guess if people are moving out, we are um we are in trouble. We're in some serious trouble. But look, 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 we've got stuff incoming, it's fine. Why do we still have zero hatchlings? I told you to make new hatchlings. It doesn't look like we have zero hatchlings. Oh, it does say this. Okay, so this is like, okay, so I understand this finally like I put a number here And then I relocate them over. That's that's good. Okay. I get it. I get it. I get it I get it, but we're not gonna relocate them right now because I don't think we have enough workers for this So we're just gonna pretend that we we knew what we were doing the entire time also we are finally getting some food which you know, is is it is high time for food because people are starving and it is real and it is a problem. And did those wagons just leave? Did they just leave? Did we pay money but they just left because we were taking too long? Ah. Uh. Okay, but we are getting fish. Do we need another stall? I don't know how this works. Are they selling all our available stocks or is it is it something that you know we gotta we gotta manually manage? Let's I guess let's add another trade and transport. We will add a market stall. Hold up. I wanna add a market stall somewhere. We'll add a market stall right here. Okay, let's take a look at what we've got. I wish I could filter them so I could see food. Like, okay, we have wheat, but I don't think we can sell wheat right for food. Oh, potato. We're gonna sell potatoes. We're gonna sell fish. Fish and potatoes. And buckwheat. And I guess flour. I don't know. Oh, the trader. What do they want to trade? Um, I would buy... You know what? We could buy... I don't think we should buy anything. We should just make sure that we either get out of this ourselves or... You know, maybe it's time for us to starve. Maybe we're not gonna survive this. But at least now, I think I understood the basics of how this works and how the coop works. Thanks again to Johnny Lore for explaining everything to me. Uh, you have been very helpful. And, you know, hopefully we're going to get through this. Hopefully we're gonna survive this absolute uh, mess that I've created. And I feel like either next video is going to be the last in this series and we're going to have to start a new town or it's going to see the triumphant return of our beautiful village to, um, you know, some kind of, some kind of sense of uh, not starving. So yeah, I will catch you next time. <laughs> If you enjoyed this video, feel free to do all the things that you do when you've enjoyed the video. And don't forget to check out some of the other videos that I make. I play a lot of city building and management games like Foundation and Dawn of Man and some other ones. Uh, so check out the stuff that is popping up on screen. I also stream occasionally on Twitch, so feel free to check that out. It's in the description. And if you have any more tips for me, please give them to me. I will welcome any tips that will allow us to salvage this poor, dying, starving village. But yeah, other than that, I hope you have a lovely rest of your life. And thank you for watching. Goodbye.